Hey, hey guys. guys! So today we're gonna talk about how to study for tests. So one tip I'm gonna give you guys is to do your note cards, do your vocab, and like to keep everything in one place. So in, if you lose your note cards, it'd be better if you have it in like a Google document because you keep everything in one place. And then at the end, when you need all those words, it's like they'll, they'll just like help you so much having it in one document. It'll help you study and it'll be so much more easier. Or if you like don't want to do a Google Doc, just have like a little box that they sell for like to hold all your note cards. Or something that I did that worked for a lot for me was it, because you still want to write it down. I, I use a notebook, like a small like notebook to have it all there, to, like to have it nice and organized. Because like if you just have note cards, and then when you're done with your note cards, like what I did like last year freshman year, I'll just throw them away. And so like we had like a big like test to study for like in a final, like you won't like you'll have to redo all your note cards or like look over them so like it's not really effective just having like a note card and throwing them away so yeah. be organized with your note cards yeah and like, your vocab yeah, words yeah the vocab words also it's like when you do your illusions like you need like all your vocab words in one place so that you can be able you you'll be able to put them in like to the your illusion because you need to use at least two vocab words in your illusion so it'd be nice if you keep them all in one place so it's with like the google document or at least have a notebook for it where you have everything in one place so basically what we're trying to say is like be organized like have a lot of like tabs or like organization like folders for your like your google drive like just stuff like that like it helps a lot in the long run yeah you'll need all that by the end like for your ap test like you'll need to be so organized to like be able to study for everything keep your notes all like in order like put dates on stuff because that that'll help you like stay organized and know what went first because you need to learn everything chronologically and like know what happened in order so keep everything like in order and also like Another tip for like studying for AP tests is like you buy an AP review book. It'll help you like if you buy it since like the beginning of the school year or once you guys start reading your the the AP book, having an AP review book will actually help a lot. Stop. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs>